Okay. Are you guys ready? Yes. Okay. Hold on. Hold on. Don't open it no, until I'm we drive off. We're leaving. Okay. We're leaving. Okay. Right. You're tempted. You're tempted. <laughs> the doctor actually just put one of the sonogram pictures inside an envelope with the gender of the baby in which we're gonna be handed to our parent. I wanna know, but at the same time, I don't wanna know. Yeah, I'm gonna do something to take my mind off of it. Pretend I'm very, very excited. Yeah, I'm gonna pretend like <laughs> <laughs> nothing just it. happened, yeah. But everything's going well, I'm feeling really, really good. It just feels so good to finally be inside the doctor's office and see everything and just hear the doctor say everything is good with my baby. And that's the best feeling of them all, so. We'll keep you guys updated in a bit. I'm gonna wait till Rissa comes back in and we're gonna chat with y'all a little bit more. So I just got the external ultrasound as Kwan mentioned. So I had to do an uh, internal ultrasound because the baby was in the way and didn't want to move. They're trying to get pictures of my cervix just to make sure everything's all good. And Kwan's baby sitting here not like, move his head. oh my gosh, Kwan's like, oh my gosh, like literally, like we can look in the envelope and find out the gender. Yeah, that's <laughs> crazy. Like, like now, I feel like now that she like said that you could see it in the picture, I want to know. But I know. At the same time, I'm like trying to fight it. I'm trying not to think about <laughs> it because I don't want to know yet. That's gonna ruin it. I know. We want a surprise, but yeah, she like tore off the one picture that had like she the said you could gender see it clearly, and I'm just like, what the f does that mean? <laughs> like, what could it possibly be? You know what I'm saying? But I don't know. I'm gonna try not to think about it. Our parents are going to see it very soon. Yeah, so I should be done soon. Well it should be done in the appointment probably like within the last like 15 minutes mm -hmm. and then we're gonna give them the envelope. Oh my gosh, I cannot believe it. It's nuts, man. Oh it my is. God. <laughs> few more days. Few more days for us. Days. But yeah, the ultrasound machine is right next to me here. So I think we're about to come back in and do this internal ultrasound. The one thing I can say is baby got so much. Oh my gosh, baby so much more developed. Yeah. And I just love being able to see everything, especially like the heart beating. Everything. And they said the brain looks so healthy and good, like yeah, everything looks perfect. Everything's measuring perfectly, everything's yeah. growing perfectly. And I'm happy that I got to see where she was placing the camera because now I know exactly where the baby's head is at, although the baby moves around a lot. But yeah. I'm always talking to my baby every single night, <laughs> so I know the type of position that the baby likes to lay in. Yeah. Because the baby's so stubborn right now, it won't move out of that position. The baby's like, nope, I'm not moving. Yeah, I'm moving. Like, she was <laughs> pressing down, trying to move the baby. The baby was not moving. So. Yeah. So we just left the doctor's office. We're walking towards her mom's vehicle in which Rissa's mom and my mom is inside the vehicle. Yes, we so... We have the envelope right there. We have the envelope with the gender right here. So <laughs> we're gonna give the envelope to our moms right now. I'm actually going to be setting up the camera with a separate SD card so that we could like see their reaction and watch it at a later date. Obviously, we're not gonna watch it today, yeah. but you just wanna be able to see their like initial reaction to finding out. Look, Look at, at them. They're so hyped right <laughs> they're now. They're in the car, they see us walking towards them. <laughs> oh my gosh, so oh literally gosh. the gender is in my hands. I know. Look at them, they're so ecstatic. Let's do another one. Y'all ready? Are you guys we're so ready? excited? Y'all are ready? <laughs> Okay, so the gender is literally right here. You guys have to have a poker face. You cannot slip Please up. Please do not say anything. Please don't say anything. Like, okay. After today, do not talk about the baby okay. with anyone else besides I each other. I was gonna say, we got it. We're not, obviously you two, <laughs> yeah, but when I have the urge, I'll be calling Nadine. Exactly. Yes, only y'all can talk about the baby together. Okay, are you guys ready? We can do this. Yes. Yes, yes. Okay. Hold on, hold on. Okay, hold don't on. open it no, until I'm, we I'm, drive I'm, off. We're leaving, okay? We're leaving, okay. <laughs> You're tempted, you're tempted. <laughs> okay, you guys, so we just handed the envelopes over to our moms. We are just not even gonna talk to them for the rest of the day. Honestly, yeah. like, we feel like they have the worst, <laughs> yeah, we feel like they have the worst poker faces. I feel like both of them are bad at keeping secrets. I don't know, like, something like that. A gender of their grandbaby is, like, a big secret to yeah. keep. <laughs> and they're both team girls, so. They're both team girls on top of that. I don't know, I don't know. I don't even have much to say. Like, I'm super <laughs> nervous right now, and I'm not gonna even find out the gender until the gender reveal. Yeah. Yeah, we have a few more days, so Kwan and I have to wait, what is it, three more days, yeah. basically? We have to wait three days. Three more days, To oh find out God. the gender of our baby. We're gonna be so busy, hopefully. That yeah, we have so much more to do, so. But how are yeah. you feeling right now, babe? I'm feeling good, like, 
the appointment went well. Mm -hmm. um, pretty much everything was fine with the baby, so yeah. it made me feel good. I'm happy. Everything was really good, and they also told me a little bit about myself. So like, they measured the length of my cervix, and mm -hmm. they said that the most common length of a cervix is like three. What did they say? Three, three centimeters. Yeah, three centimeters. Three centimeters, and mine was five, five centimeters. Five so they centimeters. said it's a really healthy cervix. I don't know. I guess the longer cervix means that you're less of a risk to go into preterm labor. Mm -hmm. So that's really good. So yeah. everything was really good today. So it was a pretty exciting day. Yeah. I'm just happy Quan was able to come into the appointment. And yeah, it was just really nice. We'll see you guys in the next video. Love y'all, Team Respect. Love you guys. Later.